Hello everyone and welcome back to another amazing episode of Archimaze Arcade. Once again, playing Dragon Age 2. Uh, we just finished up um, meeting with Fenris and completing his first quest here. That was pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna run around for a bit. Check out places and things. Okay, then I can hear. Da, 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 da. Hey guards, what are you guarding? Doesn't want to talk to me. He's the strong silent type. Whoa! Baddies! <laughs> Boom! Ow. I'm sure everything's going great over there. Whammo! Man, I have a giant sword. Oh, so um, I did uh, ask for a little bit of feedback on Facebook, uh, and a few people responded. Um, I did turn off uh, subtitles altogether, um, and the reason I did that was because I I'm actually planning to use the footage here um, in a music video at the end. Uh, I I like making music videos. If you if you haven't, check out my channel, it's great. Um, and, uh, and the captions, they kind of make the video look less good. And so I'm, I'm, I just want to capture it without the, um, without the subtitles. Uh, so unfortunately, um, it means that you might not be able to read, uh, what people are saying, or if you have any trouble understanding, I apologize. Um, but I kind of want to record it that way, so yeah. I'll, I'll do my best to not talk over them. I, I always try and do that, especially in, in a game like this where the voice acting is actually really good. So, yeah. One of the other requests I had, um, I asked if people wanted me to read out loud all the, the tomes and everything. Uh, the reply was uh, if I could just kind of summarize things or speak to the history at all, I, I can certainly do that. Uh, the other request was that I, I, uh, talk about the, I, I narrate the picking up of loot, which I think is a lot of fun. So, Guardsman Pretender, we found three silver and 42 copper. Exactly 42 copper. Why is that relevant? Because it is. We also found three more silver and another 40 copper. So, for those keeping track at home, I have 18 gold, 33 silver, and 60 copper. This is important to the plot, believe it or not. Because much like fake movie posters that are getting out and about now, Spaceballs 2, the search for more money, is very applicable here. And you know what? I'm kind of... <laughs> I realized the other day that uh, I've been running around at night most of the time, and you guys haven't seen this city during the day, really, so... I will gather my party and venture forth to the daytime. Uh, let's go to High Town in the day. I'll try and explore the the city a bit more because I, I realize I kind of been focused on just doing the quests, whereas I really haven't shown off the game as it were. So we're gonna try and do that. Ages can turn enemies brittle, which <laughs> makes them victor or something. Magistrate's Vanguard. We found this dude randomly one day. You there, Ferelden. I wish to speak with you. You're Ferelden. Wait, no, I've actually. Heard you have dealings with certain elements in the city. Yes. You can get things done on the sly. As Elementals. What is it you need? On the sly? That's a fancy way to put it. I am a magistrate in this city, and as such, I wish to hire you for a small, albeit important job. 
A man I sentenced to a life in prison has escaped custody. He's been tracked to an abandoned ruin outside the city. A request that should have been made of the guard. Yeah. What's this man's crime? Why is there such a clamor to catch this man? What has he done? He's escaped. That's reason enough to catch him. That's that's fair. Yeah, the justice system. That's all? Is there anything else I need to know? There is something, yes. There are creatures in the ruins. The guards I sent are ill-equipped to deal with such beasts. Okay, what kind of creatures? Do you know what manner of beasts they are? I don't know what they Badgers. look like. I've never seen one myself. The guards say these things have already torn through a full company of men. That's a lot. Our company is like six people. And then I imagine a company of guards is a lot more. It would be easier to seal up the entrance and let the beasts take care of him. I believe in justice, Fereldon. Not ah. unbridled slaughter. I will not let prisoners be eaten just because I don't want to get my hands dirty. Oh, I actually didn't read that question. I was just going through it. My bad. That did sound like a jerk thing to say. Uh, so why not send more guards? I'm sure, if you send in enough men this time, they do fine. Maybe some women. The more guards who know, the easier it is for this to get out. Those men gossip like old fishwives. <laughs> She's right there. All right, we can do it. I'll take the job. Bring the fugitive in alive, quickly and quietly. Not only will you be well paid, you'll have the gratitude of a city magistrate. Useful for a refugee, wouldn't you agree? Yeah, it's pretty useful for a refugee. So, a lady sunshine, what's your first act as a noblewoman going to be? A noblewoman with no fortune and no title. Looking for work, probably. Practicality is for peasants, milady. You need to do something frivolous to celebrate your birthright. Such as? Come up to the high town market and complain bitterly that there's no Orlesian silk that matches your eyes. But what if something does match my eyes? What will I do then? Insist that they're blatantly copying you and demand royalties. A big noble always has a complaint ready, sunshine. <laughs> Varric actually gives, like, nicknames to everybody. It's pretty great. Um, Bethany is Sunshine. Oh, what does he name Aveline? I think he said it earlier, actually. Um, Hawk is just kind of Hawk, so. Hello, Chanters. Though the lands suffer a thousand wrongs, the Maker yet notices the smallest of deeds. So, the main church in here is is to um, the Maker and Andraste. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not very well versed on the whole story there. Um, okay, and there's no... Sometimes there's like little post-it notes and... Chancellor's boards had a bigger role in the, the first game. You could go to a town and there'd be stuff to do. Um... But yeah, so, like, and then Hawk looted a crate and found a helmet. We don't know who owned the crate, but it had a helmet, so he took it. <laughs> this is going to be fun. Um, so yeah, the the Temple of Andraste, uh, they're, they believe in the Maker. The Chantry, not the symbol it could be. Yeah. And they have a lot of political power. Um, the the Templar Order, the the people that kind of control mages uh, in this in this uh, world, uh, they kind of respond to the the Chantry, as it were. And then we found this chest outside the Chantry, and it had a page of the Chant of Light doctrine. It looked like junk, so we took it. <laughs> And, uh, and yeah, so they get to wear, like, fun hats and robes like that. See, I told you there was stuff up here. Yeah, I guess there just wasn't any at night. Let's go inside. Meet friends. The Canari live on Parvalon, an island nation in the tropical northern climes. Some believe they, excuse me, originally came from elsewhere, since they weren't seen in Thetis until 300 years ago. 
The Canari are interesting, and I'll get to them when we see them. Uh, they play a really big role in this game. Uh, they didn't have... Your admirable restraint, Bethany. For a mage, you mean? I could also say for a hawk. But yes, for a mage. You have a sword. Why aren't you killing someone right now? Fair point. But I can put my sword down. Believe me, I have tried. So, again, uh, things are kind of contentious between mages and Templar, and by proxy, uh, the Chantry, which will also play a pretty big role in this game. Da, 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 da. So then we opened the door and found nothing. So we went across the room and opened another door and found nothing. I don't know what Hawk was doing that day. She was probably pretty drunk. I wish they'd let us help them. It'd be better than scraping by on the streets of Dark Town. Yes, it would. So, like, the refugee crisis is a pretty big deal, uh, as well. I mean, they they've been here for like a year. Um, in Kirkwall, and they still, like, it's still a, a problem. Um, Man, there's no good stuff in the church, Hawk grumbled to him herself. Da, 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 da. But we can go up here. I mean, this is like a really... I, I kind of feel bad, like I never seem to look up. And they did a really fantastic job on making this game look great. Uh, very cinematic, and I, I think more so now that I've removed the closed captions. Da, 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 nothing in here. Hawk was disappointed that day for finding literally nothing in the church. Not that Hawk would steal from the church. Just saying. Let's see. Ooh, the maker. All right, so the chantry has a whole bunch of like chants and poems and stuff, and I don't have the greatest singing voice. Um, yeah, and so everything was great. The end. <laughs> Sorry, that's my summary, guys. Uh, let's see, I think there's... Yeah, the Sermon of Divine Renata. Weakness of mortals will be the great failing of the Maker's children. Uh, we trade our honor as if it were the cheapest currency. We do not understand the integrity is a, or the truly worth, or what it is truly worth. From this ignorance, the original sin was born. Ah! The Sermon on Integrity. Um, yeah, so, like, what is integrity? Integrity is my gladiator name. And if you know where that quote comes from, write it in the comments. <laughs> Maker's blessing, child. I am Elthina, Grand Cleric of Kirkwall, and I believe you're new to our city. It was a mere thing what happened in Kirkwall, but in the end, the Maker stepped in. Yeah, sure. I'm gonna call her Grand Grand. Tell me about Meredith. I hear a lot about the Night Commander here. What can you tell me? Gossip is a sin, child. <laughs> I just... Knight Commander Meredith has an admirable devotion to her duties. To the exclusion of all else. It is not my role to form opinions on her character. But you can. Uh, why keep mages why in the galaxy? Why are circle mages here kept in a Tevinter prison? Ah. So soon you take an interest in our problems. The short answer is it was a building. A large one. Should it have sat empty? The Chantry found a use for what was once a horror. It is the nature of men to move on and forget the past. Even your blight will be a distant memory in our lifetimes. Probably. Um... Yeah... I, I think I should just go. I have things to do. May you walk in Andraste's light. 
Like, you, you can... Like, the, the blessing really doesn't do anything, but, you know, I think... I think some of the party might disprove. Oh, sorry. I didn't see that. Not that I... <laughs> Not that I completely base my actions on the, the suggestions of others. But if you guys like me to do anything, please leave a comment and I'll definitely do stuff. Uh, so I think I'm going to go back to Hightown real quick. I don't know why, like, I have Super Bowl music in my head. Da, 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 da. Okay. I'm sorry I couldn't get you more information about the circle, Bethany. It's difficult without naming you. Thank you for being discreet. I don't want the Templars at my door. No one does. Let them corral the troublemakers. I just want information. Right. Right. It sounds like I'm trying to convince myself, doesn't it? I wouldn't have said, but yes. So that that's a a big deal is like joining the circle. Um, it, it like you're not allowed to leave the circle. Uh, you are kind of stuck there, unless like you get the high enough level, and then they can let you. <laughs> they let you go out and about and do stuff for the um, for the mages. Uh, let's see, I'm... what do I got on my map? I got the dude up there, okay, that's the bone pit. And there's the blooming rose. I've had that for a while, so let's go take care of that. The Red Lantern District. Be careful if you're going into the rose. It's a favorite hangout of crime bosses and tax collectors. Sweet! I paid my taxes. The fifth play began in 9.30 Dragon. That must be, like, central time. And lasted only a year before the Archdemon was slain. The hero for Elden spared the world from the ravages of stuff. Here we are in the Bronco. My day is complete. <laughs> Let's not stay here for long. Madame Lucine runs the place for Harlan. Or with him. Or on him. It's a coterie thing. This is great. Everyone loves a place where you can just go and hang out with people. It's like a host club. Mais de la Sartier. I heard you lost something. This is. I I had never thought to see this again. Thank you. I had no idea how it was yours, but you had an icon above your head. And that's how hawks save the day. So there's people. And all these doors. <gasps> and then Hawk found a crate. And it had an enchanted staff in it. So he took it. Is it any good? Boop. Let's see. That one's got 11 fire. This has got fire. Plus, yeah, it's a little bit better. Boop. What's bound? Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't need that one. Like, stabs are probably the, the piece of equipment that has the most variety. <gasps> and then also, hiding in the back of the kitchen, Hawk found another chest. It had designs for runes of lightning and a health potion. So we took it. So now I have a new uh, rune crafting ability. I opened the door. I've got your usual ready and waiting for you upstairs. And found my uncle. Thanks, Hi, uncle. Okay. Uh, hello, Madam Lucine. The Reldon, are you? Yes. We are not a charitable organization, Sarah. If you cannot pay, you will have to take your lonely self elsewhere. She, does she push me? Here. Two sovereigns for premium service, one sovereign for standard service. Fifty silver, and someone may touch you. Briefly. 
Um, no, no, thanks. I'm good. I'm not interested. I was just instigating. I mean, investigating. Poverty had nothing to do with your decision. I'm sure. Yay! Class warfare. It's great. Hello, Quintus. Welcome to the blooming rose. Personally, I wouldn't say it's blooming precisely, but the name's not my choice. Fair enough. He didn't really ask you to wear a feather boa. All lesions, darling. You get used to it. Huh. Silly or lesions. But who doesn't love feather boas? They're like part bird, part snake. Wait, am I thinking of something else? That does sound pretty rad though, doesn't it? Like You guys look suspicious. And that's that's just me profiling. I apologize. I'm sure I look suspicious. I mean, I'm running around this place with the giant a sword on my back. Guard. What will they think of next? You have a problem with that. Me? My family's not native either. I'm just surprised. A lot of old prejudice in the guard. I'll give them plenty of reason to change their minds. You know, it's possible they're just scared shitless of you. That's my theory anyway. Oh, Varric. You're so fun. <gasps> and then, in the dark recesses of the room, Hawk found a stone toe. Didn't know what it went to, but it added a new quest, so we took it. How Hawk knew who it went to? I have no idea. So, for those with a keen eye, I don't think I can do that. Uh, and Varric can't open it yet. Bummer. Uh, for those with the keen eye, you may have noticed the layout of this place. It looks very... fairly familiar. It's a little different for this one in particular, but... Um, that's one of the shortcomings of this game. It'll, it'll become a lot more obvious later on. But uh, they really had to reuse a lot of assets in this game, including, like, maps. And then they would just kind of not open certain doors to block you from going to places. Um, that like map in particular has a, a few more unique features, but it's very similar to the uh, Fenris's new house. By some definition of the term. Do you ever wonder what your life would have been like if you were still nobles? Sunshine, nobility is just an expensive lifestyle. I've already got ah. one of those. Nobles have power too. What is happening? And responsibilities. To them? Estates, servants, investments, mercenaries, assassins. We've still got all those things. It's sunnier here, and nobody calls me my lord. I think I can live with that. Cool. You know what? I'm gonna s talk to these dudes and sell some stuff. Alright, well actually I got, is this a better shield? No. So let's sell it. And no one really uses bows. And these were all not usable. Slaver's Cowl. Mask of the Imperium. Can I wear this yet? Nope. I found a helmet. It's just a plain Jane one. Uh, butcher's bloody gloves. Some stompers. Frilled and field boots. Take those off. Slaver Lord's cowl. I'll probably just get rid of this. Yeah, I think it's for mages. And like I was saying, only only Hawk really gets any of the armor equipment. Like literally, only Hawk can use the armor, um, which is unfortunate because you get a lot of it. And it's like, well, I can't use any of this. Anywho, let's just see if there's anything else. Oh, I got a lot of junk. Uh, and then, then Hawk sold all of our junk. Read up some inventory. Sometimes I hang on to some junk, but. How much longer before we go? I 
gave up a job on the docks, please. Maybe we should go to the docks. Soon. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I need a drink. I need a pony. We don't care what we want. <laughs> Here you're having problems with the bone pit. I can help. Ah, finally someone comes to help me. Yes. You look a bit unseasoned, but I hope you'll do. I have spice. I have to suspend operations. My workers are lost in the mines or have run off. Serves me right for hiring Ferelden refugees. I sent others before, but no word. Perhaps they are putting me off. <laughs> I need someone competent to figure out what is going on. Yes, they are just putting you off. Your first mistake was naming your mine the Bone Pit. <laughs> the locals named the mine. Those fools say it's cursed. Those foolish that fools. That is why I hire Ferelden's. They may be dull-witted, but they're not superstitious. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mind what you say about my countrymen. I was not referring to you, of course. My workers are a particularly But the two desperate. people behind you. They're lucky to work for me. Few in Kirkwall will hire refugees. That's a fair point. Surely the miners had good reason to leave. I am at a loss. No miner has reported What could it be? And no one takes me seriously. Nobody will go. The bone pit must be dangerous if people are afraid to venture there. No, nothing like that. <laughs> Pay no heed to local superstition. The bone pit is mostly harmless. Mostly. Mostly harmless. You said some of your workers are Ferelden. Yes, all of them. An unruly lot, to be sure. Uh, what are you paying, What's though? the reward? I will pay handsomely. The exact amount depends on what perils you face. Uh, I think I got it. I'll head there soon. The sooner the better. Each day the mine is not running costs me more than those miners make in a year. The bone pit is just outside the city. Any map will show it. All right. I'm here to sell today, guardsmen. My shipment's late. <laughs> All right, so I think I'm going to take a quick break. Uh, I'm going to try and, and make these videos just a bit more consistent on time if I can. Uh, so thanks, everyone, for checking out the video. Please give it a like, subscribe if you enjoyed it so far. And as soon as we come back, we're going to take a look at this bone pit. Have a good one.